What's up guys, today I am able to go with three other PBA pros and ring the opening bell at the New York Stock Exchange. Yeah. Gotta cover the pro. What is, is this like, for me, I was in the hotel room and I said this is the most unique experience for the PBA that I can have. Not like, maybe not the coolest for, in terms of like, obviously, maybe like winning would be a little cooler. Yeah. What's the most unique that you've uh, had so far uh, in your bowling career? I mean, I've got to do some cool stuff, obviously all the stuff with NASCAR. Yeah. You know, getting to bowl with those guys, but I mean, I'm a, you know, I day trade and stuff, so this is pretty sweet to yeah. get to go to the stock exchange. Honestly, this has got to be at the top of the list. Yeah, that's why I was like, for me, way younger, way less accomplished in getting to do all of these like cool little things with the PBA that you do, but you got the camera. Let's go. I got the camera. Help us out. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> As for our day nine giveaway, I have this PBA signed bowling pin from the four people who were there to ring the opening bell: EJ, myself, Sean Rash, and Kyle Troop. We'll be giving this away once again, guys. The rules: you have to click that link down below in the description, and then you must be a subscriber of the channel. So if you haven't already, click that subscribe button. Follow along for more fun videos like this. Who's ringing the bell today? Well, hopefully me. I think we've I think we've all voted. <laughs> I voted. I voted. I, mean, I voted you. Okay. I mean, if it's if it's, uh, I hope it's me. I mean, we'll see when we get in there if, if uh, I'm actually told I'm going to do it. But <laughs> um, it'd be really cool if I was able to do that. So we shall see. All right. Packy. Where does this rank amongst your most unique PBA experiences? Ooh, good question. I think I was actually invited to help with the age, you know, spot, right? You needed somebody older. Every one of you guys are young. I mean, I got Tom here now, so you got two people over 40. The rest of these people, they don't even know what it's like to ache when you get out of bed yet. So this is phenomenal. Once in a lifetime opportunity. Once in a so lifetime opportunity. I'm pretty excited to go through security. I want I'm I'm curious to see what all of this is like. I, I want to know I... if it's like the White House, right? I did the White House thing one year and that was really cool. But this is right up there, probably top five moments of my PVA career. It's just something you're never gonna get to do again. I mean I never thought I'd get the invite. Just passed through security and now we are headed down the stairs to I think I got like a little breakfast for us, a little meeting room to hang out before we ring the opening bell here at about 9.30. Pleasure to welcome Bolero back to the New York Stock Exchange to ring the opening bells. We celebrate a couple things: the second anniversary of Bolero's December 16, 2021 listing on the New York Stock Exchange, and the impending kickoff to the PBA season in 2024. Right here, Tom Clark, uh, PBA Commissioner, and EJ Tackett, 2023 Player of the Year in the PBA. EJ, congrats on a great season. Thank you, Thank you, Thank you Tom. I think it's the greatest sport in the world and the greatest sport ever invented. And when you watch these players take it to the highest level it can be, it's extremely inspiring. And uh, I'm really proud and, and honored and privileged uh, to be here and have the PBA and Bolero be here today. So thank you very much. Come on, EJ, put me on the spot. <laughs> It is a, a really cool thing to be here. Um, as a lot of you know, my son was born on Wednesday, and when I got asked to do this a few weeks ago, uh, I told Natalie about it. She goes, you absolutely have to go. Like, that's a really cool experience that 
I want you to be able to, to have. So um, I got to thank my wife for being here <laughs> and, uh, and letting me leave with a, with a newborn. I want to thank everybody from Bolero. I want to thank uh, Chris from the Stock Exchange for being here, but uh, Bolero for uh, letting me do what I was apparently born to do. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, New York Stock Exchange. Are you ready to ring that thing? Yep, I suppose. Ring the ding ding! <laughs> How was your uh, bell ringing experience? <laughs> well, it was really cool. It was a little bit different than I expected. I haven't really watched to see how it happened on TV. Obviously, yeah. we've seen it before, like people actually ringing a bell, but it's just a button. It's a button. But you got to ring it for a long time. I do have to <laughs> ring it for a long time. You know, you have to hold it so that way the TV gets everything yeah. that they're supposed to get. But I don't know. It's kind of surreal being here. You know, this is the hub of the world, basically. Yeah. Um, this room kind of makes the world go round, and it definitely built this country to what it is. So Absolutely. there's so much history here. You know, we were talking about it in the back. How the stock exchange's been around now for 231 years. So it's Same. unbelievable to be standing here, and the people that have stood right here before me is can't even fathom thinking about it. So it's just such a cool experience just to be in this room. Oh, absolutely! You got some minor tech upgrades, I'm sure, over the years. But... <laughs> just a couple. Yeah. Because I'm pretty sure these uh, these screens, uh, weren't nice here LEDs, in the were, weren't here in uh, in 1800. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Well, that's awesome. Well, what a unique, exciting, cool experience that was at the New York Stock Exchange. I want to give a thank you to the PBA, Bolero, and the New York Stock Exchange and everybody who was involved in putting this together. I just want to give a huge thank you to you guys for allowing me to come along and the other bowlers to come along, help ring the opening bell for Bolero on our two-year anniversary of being a publicly traded company. So to all of you bowlers out there, why not buy just a couple of shares of the Bolero stock? Definitely one of the most unique and exciting opportunities that I've had so far in my PBA so far in my PBA career of hopefully many to come, but I just wanna thank everybody who was involved in putting this together and sending me the invite along the way.